Right, here we have is me whip real horse. Um, I said I was going to make a snow plough for it. Um, I've got one made up now. This is just a, the first one, a prototype. Uh, it just seems to go okay. It's fairly simple. I've just uh, made a simple hinge. So I'll show you how that fits in a minute. Uh, just the, the bar for lifting. And then I've just got a simple sleeve at the back that drops over the toe bar. And uh, I don't know, I haven't actually seen a proper real horse snow plough. I know they have like an A frame. I'm not sure how they fit in there or how long they take to fit. Well, uh, let's just see how long this one takes to fit. This will be my third time I've uh, tried it out. It's got a stopwatch. I started the clock going now, and there's the snow plough. Let's see how long it takes. I'm just going to push the real horse over the top of the snow plough in the line. There we go. Here's the back of the snow plough. Let's try that one first, I'll pull it back. As you can see, that there pulls over the back of the sleeve, like that. And then underneath, we have the top there, which we need to just line up. That just pushes on like that. Not the wrong side, really, but I'll do it so we can see. Push the quick release mechanism in. That bar then. I don't know if you can see that very well. That just pushes up if you've got a real arse, you know. How that fits, that just clunks in. It goes on like that. How long have we got so far? Uh, one and a half minutes. And then simply, that's it. See underneath, there's a pull and lever back. And then the sleeve at the back. There you go. I don't know if you can see. It's got the leave it short of the turbo like that, so it slides on it. And obviously we haven't got any snow at the moment, but I have tried uh, I've just pushed a bit of uh, soil and stuff about with it. And it feels very strong, you know, you can there's no bend or any giving it or anything. It's a fairly simple design. Uh, just initially, as you can see, I'd put the this box in the wrong place. Put it there, so I've just moved it across so it plays both wheels when you're using it. Like that. Um, I say if I build another one, I'll do it slightly different. And I've just put these wheels on, nylon wheels. They're quite strong. Uh, they just run level with the uh, rub on the bottom of the blade I just stop it wearing so hard and I've just put some ones on the corners just so it follows the, the level obviously if you've got your height adjustment there if you need to uh, but it runs quite well so that's it for now um, the next video you'll see hopefully um, it'll be ploughing snow. Okay, that's it for now. That's also fitted with a diesel engine if you've not seen the other videos. Uh, but you can go onto the other, onto my other channels and you'll see uh, this engine in operation uh, with the cutting deck. Cutting grass, but it's a good engine, is that?